Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I would like to bring to your attention a BBC television film called Marvelous and why you should put this on your list. This film was released in 2014 and it is based on a real person called Neil Baldwin. The character is played by Toby Jones who does a phenomenal job with embodying the character and personality of Neil Baldwin. To preface this, uh, Neil Baldwin, or as people affectionately call him Nello, has a learning disability and this film explores how he navigates his way through life. The first thing that this movie highlights is that he never lets his condition get the better of him. He is a lovable soul and is very genuine in his personality. He is very friendly to everyone and is outgoing even though people do sometimes misunderstand and ridicule him. So here's a brief plot summary of the film. Neil is a circus clown who gets sacked because he stands up to his manager and has to move back in with his mother and find another job. In this crusade, he ends up at Kiel University, not exactly having a job, but he makes a lot of friends at the university and finally ends up getting a job as a kitman for Stoke City by befriending the newly appointed manager Lou Macari, who he is friends with till this day. They also name drop a lot of people that he is friends with, including the Archbishop of Canterbury, Archbishop of Lichfield and Gary Lineker to name a few. This movie also focuses on the people around him, mainly his mother and the challenges she faces having to take care of Neil even in her old age. She's an old frail woman who is suffering from some kind of a heart condition which she hides from Neil so as to not worry or upset him. She wants to know that he can take care of himself after she's gone. And there are times where she loses her composure because even though she knows that Neil is not normal and needs special attention, it does take a toll on her as she herself is old and having to take care of Neil even through adulthood is tough. I love that this film focused on that aspect as well. I don't exactly know why I like this film so much. There are other feel-good biographical movies out there that do focus on special characters who don't let their shortcomings hold them back. But this movie just hits differently. Maybe it's because it's set in a nice quaint English village with bright creamy colors. The music is slow and very English. And the cinematography is just simple but quite effective at appealing to the heart of the viewer. Talking about emotions in this film, there is a lot of dry English humor peppered across the movie. Not going to explain instances because that would just ruin the joke. But if you prefer that kind of humor, this movie is right up your alley. There are also hard-hitting moments like when Neil deals with his mom's passing and how he copes with that loss and it was nice to have that in the movie. Overall, this is a fantastic film and it was 90 minutes well spent and I would recommend it to anyone willing to listen. And with that said, comment down below if you have any opinions and I will see you all in another video.